What's up, people of the internet? My name is Nathan, and today we have a very exciting one. Uh, for one, we're going to complete the charms. I want to get it done and get Jody's blessing or whatever her name is. And so we are going to do Coliseum of Fools and get 12k. Um, I was told that, that is one of the easiest ways to make money. Uh, so I'm going to just grind it out. I'm going to do it in like... Uh, I mean, you guys aren't going to see it. I'm just going to cut to it. Come back here. Fix the artifact. Go back to Jody, And then we'll actually start the episode. Back out to the Grim Tent. She'll be sitting. A gift for you? So greedy. But I can show you something if you're nice to me. Give them to me. Your Geo. Give me your Geo and I'll give you a gift. Pay to get a gift. There we go. 12,000. Just for her to poop out. Ah, that's nasty. But the Unbreakable Heart. So from what I believe, the Unbreakable Heart is the same thing. This charm is unbreakable. It's literally the same thing, but it just won't die. So, it's whatever. I don't think it actually adds to percent. Ooh, maybe it does. 107%. Shoot, I think we were at 106. I think it adds percent. Shoot, that means we have to do it two more times. Nine. Uh, we might have to. Uh, there's a few more things that I wanted to try. 800 is not something easy to get by. Okay. Jody's blessing. Or, or my blessing. I don't know what this lady's name is. My dear, a blessing for you. With your excessive patronage and those startling good looks, you've more than earned it. It's a kiss. Kind of sus. Received blessing. A boon bestowed bestowed by charm lovers. These blessings are love, are followed by beauty and love. Thank you. Yes, I hope my blessing brings you everything you desire. Don't be stranger. Okay. So I'm pretty sure with her blessing. Is her blessing just her following me creepily? Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I'm down, I'm down. Okay, so. We got every charm in the game. And with that, we are 107 completion. So with 107 completion, it's 112, I think, is full completion. So there's five more things to do in this game. If each gives one completion point. So assuming each one gives one completion point, we are very close. Uh, one of the things I want to do, just personally me, I want to get the last, I want to get every ending, if I possibly can. Hi, Hornet. Nothing the path is open. Uh, don't be surprised, but I'll aid if I'm able to. Okay, so, apparently, from what I found out, I'm just a donut. There's a certain way to get a special ending that I didn't know because I I just didn't believe. Oh, that doesn't make sense. There's another ending because I didn't wait. I wasn't patient, believe it or not. Being, patience, being patient actually has a purpose. I think there's supposed to be a time when Hornet comes in. There we go. So I'm supposed to just sit here. Get the Yeah, I'm supposed to just sit here. I thought. Oh wait, I realized what I have to do now. Shoot, I have to die. Right. Yeah. Get the Dream now. Okay. What's in this that's so different? What's in his dreams? Wait, wait, wait. Challenge. Oh, shoot. The Radiance. Uh-oh. I was not prepared for this, ladies and gentlemen. Does some pretty logical stuff. Okay, that does two damage. Makes sense. I mean, I gotta go through that, I assume. Halfway through the world, there's spikes. Those just explode on command. Okay. Do I get nice? No, I don't. You have to fight the Hollow Knight every time. Oh! 
That's nice, it just starts to fight. There's no cutscene, no challenge. But remember guys, the Radiance is a boss that... Uh, uh, the Radiance itself... ...does two damage. I hate these orbs, I'm not gonna cap! I hate these orbs! I can take one more hit, that's it. Crap! Holy crap, Radiance, what are you doing? Bro! Okay. If, as long as this boss doesn't have another phase, I could see myself doing this pretty easily. Nah, man! No, it spawned on my head! What? I didn't know what was going on. Okay, so the arena shrunk. That's what I'm supposed to get at. So I did make it somewhere. What are my charms? What am I rocking here? Long nail? Yeah, that's nice. Quick slash. I don't need the wayward compass. That's dumb. I'm not going to be locating anywhere anytime soon. What blessing? Does she give me soul? Is that what the blessing is? One. I'm focusing soul and metaspore cloud. That doesn't help me. Thorns of agony when taking damage. Wasn't there one that increased my... Uh, to increase my... Um... I could have sworn there was something that increased my invulnerability frames. Yeah, this one right here. But I can't get rid of anything else. I like my stuff. I like the long slash. Wait, steady body. Oh, this one's kind of pointless, I think. So this one I'll go for the more invulnerability frames. Because there are so many times where I take damage, and then the invulnerability wears off so fast that I can't not take more damage. I, I'm, I'm panicking. Mm. Okay, second phase is just a bunch of knives coming down in my forehead, man. Nah, no, man, allow it! They just hit you with everything. Radius can suck it, bro. What in the seventh dimension? Why do I have to fight her like this? This is worse than fighting her normally. Ah, oh, she still does two damage. I see. What? I think Bird Lady should allow it. Just saying. This at least gives me some healing time. No. Nah, that shouldn't have hit me. Swords? No. No, nah, man, allow it. What? What? They didn't even give me a second to respawn, and I had to react. Nice. Get the, the fact that I have to do this every time just to get into the fight. This is the only phase, but like, see, with here right now, at least, there's that minute where they give you a break and I can just focus on something else. Ugh. 
then bomb phase. I freaking hate bomb phase. Once again, we do bomb phase. I think it's funny. I think by far this is my least favorite boss, and that's saying something. Because we freaking had to deal with Grim, and you think Grim would suck. But I actually really liked Grim. I think it was a well-balanced, educated boss. <sighs> and then there's this kid. And I missed. There's more bombs. I mean, they're easy enough to dodge, but there's still bombs at the end of the day. Man, like, allow it! The game just doesn't allow anything. That's... Okay. There's obviously lore here about how the knight, like, how this girl gets consumed by the knight or whatever. I like how it gives me time to heal, but it's just not enough. The bomb phase? Why not? I can't run from them, I gotta just go up and around. And I fell. Nah, man, allow it! Nice, I got some heal though. Oh, I hate bomb phase, I swear. I swear it, guys, I swear it, I hate bomb phase! Oh, I hate this so much. The amount of platforms are going down, aren't they? Oh. Is that it? I beg that that's it. Rip the radiance out of the sky, let the Hollow Knight consume it. Kill this stupid good enemy. Damn! Possess him! Give him the goo goo! So is the Hollow Knight like my dad? He's like, you are fuck. I think I mentioned this in the past. Yeah, hook him up, man. Make sure this radiance can't get out. Darkness forever. Let's go. Freaky Radiance. Ooh, sit down. Holy crap, I'm sweating my butt off. Oh. <sighs> Let's see this ending. It's probably a pretty important ending. There's a whole side boss just to do it, so. This, I'm assuming, is the true ending. If I had to assume. Poor Hornet. And I'm dead. An achievement dream no more defeat the radiance and consume the light yep well i hope you guys enjoy if you did hit the like button down below if you like what you see consider subscribing i post every single week and i'll see you all in next week's video peace 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 thanks for watching